That would be pretty scary. Hey there, everyone! This is Al Cowbling, Super Castlevania 4. I gave myself a rewind. Because <laughs> you just don't know. And check it out, we're on the front lawn of Dracula. Did you notice something? Did you notice something about the map that was displayed there? I'm gonna give you a few more seconds just for you to think about it. That's right, it's a bird! No. Uh, I don't know if you've noticed. I'm just gonna say it right now, right now. There's no bats! There was no bat. Look at that, I can throw two axes. Two axes at the same time on screen. That's pretty good. You kinda want axes in this level, so that you kinda want axes for this level. So we're just gonna let that cross rot away. Uh, but yeah, there are no bosses here. There's no boss zone. This just kind of falls apart. Like, this is more than a swamp. There's like a ruin here. I don't know, man. I feel like Dracula is not taking care of his, like, front lawn. But also, he's dead every century for a century. It's not really clear how long Dracula gets to stay alive before a, a Belmont comes and just kind of slays him a little bit. So anyways, welcome to the Harpy Generator place, where Harpies are generated. They're carrying a thing, and you'll notice I am being extremely careful, extremely considerate about making sure the Harpy dies before said thing is released. That is not accidental. I don't want that knife. Who would want that knife? I almost fell. Who would want to fall? Not me. Alright, I don't... I'm just gonna do that to destroy you, I guess. <laughs> Why does that hurt? <laughs> I mean, okay, let's assume that, you know, the Belmont family treasure whip that was used to destroy vampires for generations and generations. This is why they release a little imp and it's super annoying. Um, it's safe to assume, I think, that it probably has some holy properties to it. And so, its mere existence might be harmful to a lot of the denizens of the Dracula estate. These wacky and why- oh look at that, they're just trying to be me, that's- that's- that's cute. These big roaming ivies though, that, that is just bad maintenance, like there's just no excuses for that. They, they're, they, they, no, this is not a style you're going for, Dracula, come on, that is just bad rampant- whoa. That bat was not impressed by my little twirl there, so you know why- What's that? Oh, and my time! Oh jeez, okay, it's slow. Hey, it's a friend from another game. Why are there statues here? I do not know, by the way. By the way, this is World 5. World 5 is really short, it's just the entryway. But this is where the real game begins. We did it. We have made it to Castlevania. It has its own map. It's a lot less... flavorful? <laughs> it's a floor plan and there's a dog. It is melting away. And by the way, yeah, I believe this is a reference to... 1-1 one -one of Castlevania? I remember it being a lot more... similar than that, though. But I'm still gonna stand by what I thought I was gonna be saying. <laughs> so, welcome to Castlevania. I know I've mentioned a few times during this playthrough that, you know, this game's hard, man. This game's hard. I distinctly remember, once we get to Castlevania... Oh, I don't know. Whatever. Hey, it's the classic axe knight. That's fun. Wanna axe a quest? I've said that before. Using my own axe as the prompt instead. It's pretty good. <laughs> a lot of varied things I can say. Um... Yeah, so back when I got this game, back when I was a kid, and I was playing this game, I was trying to... Every level, once we got to, to Castlevania itself, every level was like a one month long wall or something. Like something incredible like that. I'm not saying this is gonna be the case here. I'm a lot more... Because you got nonsense like this? Hey guys, you like Mode 7? Okay, this is something. Let's cry a little bit. <laughs> like, why did. Why is this? I don't know. But we got the sweet pendulum just swing over nothing. 
we're in the room where it flashes red, don't worry about it. It's the rage room. But yeah, like I said, like just everything as of now, wow words. Everything was like a month, like every individual level. So, um, I don't know. Like, I, I just think it's fun to contrast my abilities as a youth who just played for fun to an adult who still mostly plays for fun, except I got the experience of so many, like, harder games. I mean, like, even, like, I feel like in Mario, where the jump physics are significantly better, the way this is spaced and the way it's moving... Like, there's just something that radiates discomfort about all of this. However, you get pretty bad frame rate, and... But you also get, like, the candles, like, the candlelight dangling, and I think it looks super rad. Like, look at that, it's like, whoosh, like, that is super rad cool. Okay, I think I feel more comfortable jumping into it in this state. Like, you can do both, as long as the chandelier isn't moving. Yeah, this must have, like, in itself, cost me, like, a week of being stalled. I just did it in the first place. But again, like, it, I can't compare myself like that. That is cheating. Is this where there's a thing? There's a thing. Is it around here? Am I the right place? Back. Because uh, there's a place with a thing, and if I miss it, I mean, I miss it. And I, it's not the end of the world. But I will be sad. But I think it's around here. Oh, wait, no, it just crap. Wow, also, the little... Ah, this thing, here we go. Secret passage. Don't try to understand. Old man and his puppy are here. They are ghosts. That's what they do. Yeah, big me! They still hurt, though, sadly. Uh, and I'm kind of stuck. Get out of here. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I th I'm so sorry, both of you. I'm so sorry. I, like, I don't mean it, but I will say it constantly. Look at that! The, 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 the ghost of the old man! Like, died, like, double died. His dead form died of grief, because I killed his dog. And here I am, just power walking everywhere still. <laughs> Look. I lost a little bit of damage, so I think that puts us even... And like, it plays a music here that's super nice, that's like unique to this room. I did not know about this room when I was a child. This is something I've learned of in adulthood. Full disclaimer. Bad, uh... Oh, we got, we got ladies. Whoa, yeah, okay. Oh, now I got an axe, well, you know what? Oh, I might die here. Like, ladies, you know, they don't do anything to attack me. Like, they don't have, like, an attack, they just float around. Have Wacky Bubble! I don't know, don't worry about it! <laughs> it's just Wacky Bubble, alright? Sometimes it's time for Wacky Bubbles! They go whoosh! Whoa! Here's a ghost running after me. Well, I mean, he's dead by now. He's been done for a little bit. I don't want to destroy this too early in case it's me. And I, like I want it to be, I want the meat to be at a place where I can grab it before it disappears on me. Be meat. It's two. I mean, two is good. Two is a good thing to have. Oh, wacky bubble. It goes whoosh. Like, what is this supposed to be? Like, for real? Like, it's just, it's a glob. It's a, it's a, it's just a magical glob that goes on. That's the sound it makes, I'm pretty sure. Give me money. I want Dracula's money. I'm here to collect. <laughs> oh, look at that! It's Axe Guy! Whoa, he's on a steppy! I'm gonna step up to... Whoa, bad attack. I did not see them coming. I did not see them up there. I saw them flying. Oh, I'm full of heart. I need to use stuff more. Yeah, I do. Whoa, axe. It's an axe battle, except I'm not using my axe, but I could. I didn't. So remember the flippy block? That's that, except they got spikes. And I fell. I didn't jump fast enough. So here's a fun thing about Simon Belmont. If you jump from a height, um, I don't know if you've noticed, but there's a clear, like, crouching animation, like that. You need to jump before he kneels, basically. After he lands, but before he kneels. 
that's how you make it. Otherwise, you just fall through. You don't get hurt. So I don't know why the spikes are there, because things just kind of restore themselves, but no, yeah. Uh, so if it looks like I'm having more trouble than realistically I should have, that's why. There's just like, there's landing lag that is very strong. Like, it even plays a sound effect. It plays a little clock sound. It's... it's a decision. Uh, uh, there you go. This time I pressed jump very quickly. Both times. I did it. Pachwee. That's how I'm making up the sound of the whip coming from my mouth. Uh, wow. There's spikes here. Don't worry about it. I will worry about it. Thank you. These are just normal blocks. Blocks that crumble look like that guy instead. Oh boy. Oh, go away! I don't want you to hurt me. So here we got a Surfagolus. I tried to attack it and oh come on, I want your meat. I want this old meat! Theater meat! The best meat there is! Not true. Probably! I mean, there's no reason to judge it to say it. Why didn't the casket do anything? I mean, the casket was there to rumble. It's like, hey, I'm wiggling! <laughs> Wanna watch me wiggle on the casket? It's like, no, not really. No, okay, so now we're in 60. I'm gonna. This guy's gonna hammer bro a bone and I'm gonna jump right into it. Alright? I mean, I said alright, it's already been done. Ooh, red skeleton! They're the skeleton of bones! Well, no, yeah, that's what a skeleton is. Clearly, I said the wrong word and I'm not correcting myself, so now that's just what I said. Uh, their deal is, as you can see, they get back up, you know, they're tireless. I mean, that's what a skeleton could do, like, you know. They're already kind of... Oh, shoot. Uh, this here. Do this here. You can go here, hit this wall with a chain, and expect that to shatter somehow. Yeah, good luck. That skeleton guy is there. He's, uh, he's there to taunt you. Good meat! Because, like, I don't think he actually exists. Also, there's very, very obvious hands in the wall jutting out. I don't know if you've noticed them. It's very subtle in there. Can I just, like, hit the hand? Alright, I guess this works out and just destroying the whole combo. It's just very silly. Like, they tried to taunt you, well, attract, bait you is the word, with, uh, with a big heart once, like that. But then they just kind of move on with little hearts. It's like they lost complete confidence in their own trap very quickly. I think that's really fun. I keep picking them up, even though I can get more than 99. But man, game, give me a reason to use those axe. Look at that. So, see, these, they will react. Oh, my time is low. I've used up too much time to get. Look at my time. It is super low. I'm probably going to die from timeout. Table! Um... Okay, I mean, unless one of these gives me a clock, which I don't think is a thing. That's very rude, by the way. We just kind of bump into me like that. Now we got dancers, people dancing. Like, we had individual men and women earlier. Well, now they're... Okay, well, you know what? I'm, well, I would have died of timeout. See, and because I was, like, on timeout pressure, I started to play badly. See, it kind of feeds itself. It's a feedback loop. And I got this tiny chain. How is that gonna work out? We'll find out real soon! This is so weird. It's happening though, so you know what? That's our life. It's gonna go like, I just... Yeah, but you can't... Yeah, there you go. There's just the right distance where you can't affect it. And uh... You gotta find it. There you go. Otherwise, it will bump into you. And I mean, you, know, you don't need to be a vampire hunter to be able to, you know, you, you, we can connect with this. Bumping into a table hurts. Like, it really hurts. There's no enemies. <laughs> that was silly. Like, that's what I feel silly about having, like, enemy clear power-ups that are in static places. What happens if there's no enemies there? Like, it's just silly. Like, and like, like, it's not like they made sure, I feel like, to make sure that it'd be populated with enemy. I don't know, it was a, here's just a one-up. <laughs> it just says one-up. I don't know, Simon knows what to do with that, I guess. No power-ups at all, huh? Alright, because it's boss time, Mr. Guy. You can tell because the room stopped moving. 
Now it's moving. All right, so we got the dancing ghost. A beautiful couple in love. Well, I'm in love with killing Dracula, so it's all good. Look at that, they split apart. So what did he do? What, what did he do? What are their patterns? I don't know. Because every time I get here, this is exactly what happens. I stand next to them, I whip them, and then they die. Like, I just... <laughs> But also, I don't know if you've noticed, but Simon is huge, right? So I feel like because of the amount of real estate he takes in a given screen, I feel like it might be kind of hard to make a boss fight that feels balanced. And that's a pause sound, by the way. So maybe that's why that happened, but it still feels a little kind of like, ah. Uh. So yeah, all right, we got a cool boss design. Flap, 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 hurt, hurt, hurt. I, I won the damage race. Which I feel wouldn't be so bad, but I feel like that has been most bosses up to now, too.